23 ABC's digital update is brought to you by West Medical. Good morning, I'm Callan Hallman. Here's what's making headlines across the county. The latest numbers released this morning on the County Health Department's COVID-19 dashboard indicate a slight drop in new cases today. Taking a look at the latest number of positive test results, 474 new cases today compared to yesterday's 522. As for the number of new deaths attributed to the coronavirus, public health reporting 11 today, bringing that total to 583. The California Department of Public Health has given the OK to begin using a specific lot of Moderna vaccine doses that have been paused. Earlier this week, the department paused distribution of the doses after reports of possible allergic reactions around the state. The department says after meeting with specialists, they found no scientific basis to continue the pause. In other news, local Senator Shannon Grove is no longer in charge of state Republicans. The GOP voted unanimously to replace Grove with Senator Scott Wilk from Santa Clarita. This comes after state Republicans lost two seats in November. Grove will still keep her Senate seat but will no longer lead the party. Senator Wilk commended Grove for her hard work and commitment. Now let's switch gears and take a look at your weather forecast. Yes, as we take a look outside at yesterday's system continuing to push out of the way after impacting us for several days, the next system not here just yet, and it's the first in a line of storms. So today, a beautiful in between day, some upper 60s, about 10 degrees above average, with mostly sunny skies and moderate valley air quality. Low 60s into the Kern River Valley areas, 59 in Glenville, 50s into those South Mountains with a healthy westerly breeze at last, and that breeze keeps you in the 60s down into the desert today. But heading into tomorrow, the first in a series of storms will arrive. You see increasing clouds, some spotty showers for Friday afternoon and evening. So cold in the mountains that it will start turning to some light snow, possibly all the way down to 4,000 feet at past level by Saturday morning and throughout the day on Saturday. But this is the precursor to a stronger, wetter, colder storm arriving late Sunday into Monday. Sounds good, Elena. That'll do it for this update. Have a great rest of your day.